Look at somebody and say, I am unstoppable. Whatever you thought you lost, whatever is taken from you, God will compensate you. All things work together for good to those who are called according to his what? Purpose. All things. May your life attract people that have something to do with your destiny. You remember some years ago, one of our brothers, Greg Gobadia, was kidnapped. And they blindfolded him. And they took him to Akure Road and took him into the bush. The man that sent to kidnap said, don't kill him. I want him to know I'm the one that killed him. When he got there, he said, open his face. That was, that is favor. That is where grace did the talk. Oh. Grace is speaking here. Meanwhile, we were praying here in the compound for him. Mistaken identity. When they remove what they put on his face, he said, this is not the man. This is not the man I sent you. He became angry. He said, take this man back. That's how Greg is still alive today. May this grace speak on your behalf. Favor with God and favor with men. Favor is a spiritual element that if it, doesn't trans, if it doesn't translate and transmit to you through men, you will only be talking about favor in heaven. You know what this favor did? Jesus was 12 years old and he sat with lawyers. He sat with the Sahendrins. He sat with Pharisees and the the, 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 the sad you see, far you see. Because those who see from afar always criticize. And those whose belly turn when God bless you always criticize. Sad you see, far you see. And God gave him favor. For three days, he was talking with them, asking them questions. You know why? Favor carries you to where your leg cannot carry you. There are some songs I sing I like, and there are some I don't sing. My leg carry me go where? Which leg? It is favor. This leg has no power. It's only favor. He said, I will order the step of the righteous. Favor. Somebody say favor. favor. On the last night before he was betrayed, the favor gave him an upper room. The, he didn't know the man. He sent his disciples. He said, go and tell the man, I want to have the last supper with him, the last supper with him. And the man provided. That is what favor does. That they may not know you. But you carry this, this, this influence. It's, it's just all around you. It's an influence. It's the presence. That whatever you ask is given to you. May you receive it this morning in the name of Jesus. Nobody has ever made it in this life without favor from men. Go and check out. No one. Somebody needs to like your face to favor you. You must be in contact and have a connection with men, with women, with boys, with girls. Because this favor of God on you must pass through them. God won't drop it. 
Somebody say, I hear. Ah. May you find favor with men who are in authority. Yeah. It's just one day. Somebody say, one day. Queen Vasti was disliked by the husband. Action. There are some things I'm going to say in this series of teaching. Do not take your position for granted for nothing is permanent. Do not think you have arrived for anything can change any moment. Do not be too proud to submit. And the king said, I want to display my wife. And Vasti said, tell the king that I am busy with visitors. Who made you a queen? Madam, you are no missus without the husband. You don't have that title. Missus without the husband. So it is husband that qualify you to be what? Missus. So respect what gave you the title. Today, they, after, from now, they will be addressing you as Mrs. Even when somebody wants to talk to you, he will, he, will, he will look at you and see if not be your husband. I will tell you something. Abby, yes. <laughs> respect this man that gave you this opportunity to be called Mrs. No reach there and say, if you talk, my papa will put you in prison. No disgrace me, oh. Uh, oh boy. No try, I'm, no beat him, oh. You beat him, I go send those who will beat you. Whatever she does wrong, talk to me. I know what to do. Here, yeah? not say I go show you say I'm your rubber man. No, no show him, oh. <laughs> if you show so you be a rubber man, me I go tell you so I be Igbo man plus Bini man. Yeah. Somebody say I hear. Yeah. And just that act, the king disliked her. It therefore matters how you relate with people in authority. Do not trample on authority. Do not say authority. What can you do? You can say to your boss, pata pata, you sack me. Friend, he can sack you and can do you too many things 10 years after. That's why I said to you, try to maintain relationship. Don't break it. Because you do not know the relationship you will need when you get to your next five years. Don't spoil it. Don't. Don't close the road. You will pass it again. Don't go poo-poo on the road. Because when you pass it next, the poo-poo go the smell. And the king disliked Vasti. And dethrone her. A queen of a kingdom lost her position. For favor was against her. Why did Joseph suffer? His brothers disliked him. Who likes you out there matters. Am I communicating? His brothers disliked him. That's the reason why they sold him into slavery. When people dislike you, friend, they can go any length to harm you. 
If they can't get you, they look for your children. If they can't get your children, they look for something that belongs to you. Joseph's brothers disliked him. And what was the resultant effect? 13 years of suffering. I know that it ended well. But did he need to suffer like this by people who he loved? What about Jephthah? It was dislike from his brothers. His father's inheritance. But tonight, don't say my uncle you are stupid. You can't do anything. Your uncle can do many things. So. <laughs> you know those of you who don't go to village. You don't visit. And your father and mother is alive. Don't worry. The day they will come you go go village. Oh. Ah, they will shift you like wheat. <laughs> they will deal with you. My auntie was just buried on Thursday. That's the last of my father's generation. Gone. And guess what? <laughs> they said to these sons. You didn't give cow for your father. Your father did not bring cow for his own father. Therefore, you cannot bring cow. Come bury your mother. This ain't a joke. Mama, they go church. My auntie was a very good woman in the church. Do everything in the church. They have said to the church, the woman at the village say, lie, lie. Until they settled that. Now something happened on Thursday. I was briefed last night. They now brought a cow. Because you must bury your mother with a cow. They now brought a cow to the village. I am the head of the family. So my portion is the head of the cow. You can, you can imagine that? A whole cow. They not give me leg. They not give me hand. They say now the head. Now waiting there the head. They gave me the head. Then the one that is following me is to take the neck. They consult book. They say he has not buried the mother. Hey. Isaac. They say he not buried the mother. So for that reason, he can't take the neck. The neck pass to the one following him. They say you shouldn't near there. You shouldn't come close. <laughs> you know what is leading me to this? Make peace with demo. That your uncle. He can do you many things. You need favor with men. Am I communicating? I didn't have challenge when I went to bury my mother because it's difficult to bury your mother than your father. You know why I didn't have challenge? I took care of my uncles. I took care of them. Visit them. Send them Christmas gift. You are afraid. If I send them Christmas gift, they will use their witchcraft to touch me. You don't have power. You are empty. That's why you are talking. If you have power, send them Christmas gift. Who be monkey? Who will touch you? Which witchcraft? You and witchcraft, who is stronger? Tell me. Tell me now, who is stronger? You or witchcraft? You see, you don't even know. You don't even know. Ah, oh, yeah. Oh. You don't even know who is stronger. Who is stronger? Then if you are stronger, why would you not bless them? He said, if you bless them and they not decide to do anything against you, it's like putting a hot coal of fire upon their head. I got to the village the first time in one year, one month. I got there and I assembled all the women who had been sweeping our village and I bought a wrapper for them and I gave them. They were happy. Favor with men and women. If you talk anything against me, those women will tie wrapper after you. <laughs> Am I communicating? Joseph suffered. Jephthah suffered. 
because he didn't have favor. He was depending that Papa is there.